Well, we are learning new details about a just announced program to help people fleeing the war in Ukraine come directly here to the U.S. The Biden administration says the Uniting for Ukraine program will streamline refugee applications. And News Nation's Evan Lambert is live. So, Evan, this pro with the program, refugees will no longer need to enter through Mexico. Nicole, starting Monday, Ukrainian refugees, some of whom had been coming in through the southern border, they won't be allowed in if they go that way. But this program, it offers a new route. The Biden administration saying today it will fulfill its promise to welcome tens of thousands of refugees fleeing the war in Ukraine to the United States. The president outlining a new program meant to speed up their arrival called Uniting for Ukraine. This program will be fast. It will be streamlined and will ensure the United States honors its commitment to go to the, to the people of Ukraine and need not go through our southern border. The U.S. will take in up to 100,000 Ukrainians. Under the program announced today, refugees must be sponsored by an organization or U.S. citizen. A senior Homeland Security official saying refugees will undergo, quote, rigorous vetting, as will their American sponsors. Ultimately, refugees who come through this new plan will be allowed to live and work in the U.S. for up to two years. Applications for the program go live on Monday. An administration official say that's also the day when Ukrainian refugees will no longer be allowed through the southern border. Customs and Border Protection says more than 15,000 Ukrainians have crossed into the U.S. over the last three months. The U.N.'s refugee agency saying yesterday nearly 5 million have fled the country since the war started. And Nicole, those sponsors will also have to prove to the Department of Homeland Security that they can financially care for the Ukrainian refugees that they want to bring over. Nicole. All right, Evan, thank you for that. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.